well, we're about to make a table console, me and my daughter. And uh, it's gonna go right behind this couch here. So when we have like a fight party or whatever, if we run out of room for people, you know, sitting on the couch here, they can sit behind here and watch the TV. You ready to get started? Yeah. All right. All right, we're using this board as a template. So, go ahead. Oh. Yeah, not so hard next time, gradually. Good gracious. Whoo, scared the hell out of me. Hi. I forgot to tell you, you know, uh, graciously, slice through the wood. You're like, bam! <laughs> Sorry, daddy. Air Force strong, huh? <laughs> okay. Slow. Much better. Mm -hmm. Much better. Good it gracious. It looks cleaner. It looks cleaner, one. right? Now we're using that wood as a template for the rest. So we're getting ready to give it just a test shot. Just a test run. Why not, right? Wow, 36 would have been way too small. And that's flat on it right there. That's good? Mm -hmm. All right. Good idea, Mammy. So we was thinking about running this through the joiner, but we really don't have to. It's pretty tight. All the seams are tight. It's gonna look rugged. We're gonna knock some dents in it and put a little bit of, you know, a little attitude on it. So yeah, it's, it's not a big deal. So we're about to get this staple out. Yeah, we want to make sure that it's tight as possible. We don't want, we don't want any problems. Stay tuned. I'll be back. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to use some wood glue. I glued this pieces of wood together without putting the pocket hole screws in, po pocket holes in first. So now my daughter has to hold it up. I'm gonna have to put the jig here and then clamp it like that. Because I'm an idiot. <laughs> And then when it goes all the way in, hit the button and reverse it out, okay? Is that in? Uh-huh. Yep. Hit the button, reverse it out. Just like that. Push, keep going. Well, you have to make sure that it's, uh, it's, it's in that groove. Uh-huh. Yep, right there. There you go. Good. <laughs> perfect. There you go. I'm going to make the pocket holes, and you come behind me and put the screws in. You think you can do that? Yeah. Thank you. What screws are you? Are these square? Take a break real quick so I can cook some dinner. Two, 
Got some uh, cowboy beans going. Some jambalaya rice. Got some fried chicken down here. Oh, baby. Mm, mm, mm. What'd you say? And I'm a senior. You a senior? Yeah, that's right. Today's the first day of school, so this is our first year uh, as a senior in high school. Get out of my video! Oh my gosh, I'm trying to walk like a model. Are you getting it? Yeah. Does that look like... That looks like how you're doing? No. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like that video like this. Well, since this table is so long, right? We're gonna put legs here at the end and then we're adding additional two legs in the middle as well as legs on the on the back here on the other end so um that's what i'm going to be cutting here and uh yeah that's just to give it more stability to lay this down because I'm getting ready to stain it's gonna rain outside today so I was gonna take it outside and stain it but uh, can't do that because we have scattered thunderstorms about 75% and I don't want to take that risk. I have to do the legs so I'm just gonna quickly do that real quick to run back to Lowe's and pick up a little bit more wood since I decided to add on those extra uh, legs on the table in the middle I had to go back and replace the wood that um, that I'm gonna be using for the countertop because I'm putting a barrier and I'll show you guys when we get to the house <laughs> a little dents in it so we can get that rustic look hey if you guys want you can carve your initials in it Before it's the, ours here, can I, say, you put I put an a right there it doesn't look like an a it looks like a ah. here. Oh. so when your kids come and see it they're like whose initials is this i'm like that's your mama's granddaddy granddaddy oh my god who's your initials is this <laughs> decided to go with the white stain Yeah, my wife came home from work, tired, but uh, the white stain came out nice. I might have to wipe this one off here, but the white stain came out very nice. You can see the wood grain in here. It is, it's, it is beautiful.
so I got the legs on and then now I'm gonna put support beams between here and support beams between here This table is heavy. My daughter, she went out, went out with her friends, so <laughs> I had to lift this thing by myself. But um, yeah, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add this board right here onto the back side of here to have a splashback. I guess you could say something, you know, where you can rest your cups up against. Yeah, it's gonna go all, right along here. Give it a light sanding and then add on a second coat of polyurethane on here and then I my wife came uh she my wife told me that uh this table's too high it's not high too high for us to sit right here and watch there but i'm gonna build a bar here so if people sit at the bar want to turn around and watch the fight that's going on over here we're gonna be blocking them and it has she said it has to be leveled with the couch here so it is pretty high so I can cut it down here you know there's no problem I can cut it down to size but then I'll have to find some stools that's big and uh, small enough to fit underneath here because these stools are just way too high yes I am gonna have another TV there so they can watch the fight or whatever's going on over here but um, just in case they want to turn around uh, we don't want to block so I'm gonna have to I have to change some things.